does it fit. Welcome back to another GM Golf video. Today I'm out here at Madeira's Golf Club with Claire Hogel. Hello. And we are going to be playing a nine hole match. How are you feeling going into this match? Are you feeling confident? I feel good. I haven't practiced in a couple weeks, but you know, I'm all taped up and we're, we're ready to go. I've seen your putting in a couple vlogs before. Right. It's really not impressive. Ooh. I have some confidence in my putting and you know, everybody always says it comes down to the putting. So I think it'll be a good match, but I think ultimately I'll come out on top. This course looks tough. It looks tight and it looks beautiful. Let's get into it. <laughs> First hole, looks like a dog leg to the left, par four. 394 yards. I got a four iron, I'm just trying to put one in play. Looks like you can kind of go through the fairway into some trouble. Little stinger is the goal. Format for today is I'm going to be playing the tips. Player is going to be playing the whites, which is two up from the tips. Straight up, no strokes, match play nine holes it's about 332 from here it should be good it'll even out she gave me a tip on the range on how to improve my putting so we're going to use it today i'm gonna be dialed in oh my god Check in the middle all right that's fine all right i'm really far away I'm, I'm taking a longer club than i did off the tee so not the way we planned it i Go. just have the chunk today Go. Oh, Seriously? I think. I mean, I saw it down. I We're know. just short of the green. Pretty prime position here. 153 yards, left to right wind. I gotta put one close. P wedge in hand. Nice. Be good. All right. Nice wow. shot. Sit. Quit spinning. Right. Wow, those greens are fat. <laughs> She's still about 60 yards away, so we'll see if she can put one close. I kind of have to make this because he's in for birdie and this chip is for par, which is really not the way I wanted to start. Go in. No. Oh. No. <laughs> oh. I mean, I've seen stranger things. Out of the first hole, you take it to one up. On to the second hole of the day. A little bit of a dog leg to the left. This is the first time I've ever played this course down here in San Diego, but it's pure so far. Everything seems to be in really good condition. The only thing I see here is it's probably the smart play is definitely to hit four iron. However, I can't. No, Grant, what do you think? No, Should I get aggressive? Please, no, I like the drive. No, no, no. You can get close to this green. You already want up. All right, I like it. You know what? We're going with the big D stick. Not necessarily the smartest play, but. Oh, Ooh, this one's right. <laughs> oh, what the heck? Perry. It's in the bunker? Yeah, she'll be fine though. Probably gonna be like 125 yards out. All right, got a driver, which I like because that means I'm probably not gonna make contact with the ground. So just gonna, um, yeah, hit it up there like one does. Oh, nice. Wow. Yeah, hey, that was bomb. Wow, that we is still throw. rolling. It's all good. 136 yards. Straight downwind up the hill. Probably gonna be a little 50 degree. She's in prime position though, like dead center of the fairway, probably 120 out. So I gotta hit a good shot. That's good. Good Ooh, that might be long. Nice. All right, well, we're potting, I think. 112 up the hill. I think I'm gonna be going with um, probably a pitching wedge in the back of my stance. Whoa. Okay. Straight at it. Oh, that is literally perfect. Okay. Wow. Nice approach. That's what we're looking for. <laughs> what is this, guys? Walking up to the green, Claire sticks it to like three feet. Pretty much a gimme birdie. I'm still like 30 feet down the hill, breaking over this ridge. I don't know if you guys can really see it on camera. I basically need to make it because she says her putting's really good. If I can hold this, it's be huge for the program. Let's go. Oh, that's good. Well, that was fast. Bruh. All right, that's good. Oh my. Nice birdie. Guys, as you know, I say this, it's better to lose on a birdie than a par, so 
but I could have made a par and but still would have lost. <laughs> on to the third hole of the day. Looks like a par five, but it's straight downhill. It just does not seem like a driver hole. 583, but there's trees on the right. I think the smart play is probably hybrid. Pretty conservative. You know what, we're hitting driver. No, All right, I like that. No, Grant's really getting in my no. head today. So well. That's gonna be right. Get right. Oh no. I did not see you hit a drive like that all day yesterday. In a driver. It's a little bit into the wind. Oh, oh no. <laughs> that might be okay. No. No? I don't think so. After a little adventure into the desert up there, we cannot find her ball. She's gonna have to drop and I'm gonna probably also have to drop. So I hit it in the trees, she hit it in the desert, so. I'm about 200 yards to the ravine, but it's all downhill. So I'm just gonna take like a six iron. Oh. Nice swing. Nice. Perfect. Guys, here's the situation. I could get it there if I could get it over these trees here with my three wood. And I'm kind of debating on it, but I'm probably just gonna hit an eight iron. My ball like went in up there from what Grant and I saw. So take that line through the pin. I'm gonna drop back here. I'm just gonna hit an eight iron. Wow. All right. Should be good over there. Can I have a shot at the green for par? 120 here guys. I'm gonna hit a 54 degree. All things considered, this isn't a terrible position, obviously. Could be worse after a tee shot like that. Go. Chunk it. Ah. 110 into the wind, so it's gonna be another pitching wedge for me. I'm gonna divot, so I just gotta make sure I catch it clean. It's not that bad of a divot. I'm being dramatic. Terrible. Definitely not what we want here, but this chip is actually looking pretty easy. It's definitely makeable. I'm just gonna give it a run, but I don't know. I'm not gonna try and get too aggressive. It looks like it's actually sloping away from me just a little bit. Maybe put a little spin on this. Nice. That almost went in. It's right at that range. Grant, you know what I'm talking about. Oh, I know. It's right at that range for me. Grant, should I make him put it? Oh, yes. <laughs> it's kind of just a little side hiller, slightly downhill. Just gonna kind of play it a couple feet out and let it die in there. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I have to make this. Oh, wow. <laughs> Never a doubt. <laughs> Wow, pretty good. Hey. Not bad. This is only a foot and a half, but we're working with something. Match is still all square. I mean, and honestly, after those tee shots, pretty solid bogey, get on the whole four. Ooh, okay. 185, pins tucked. This is an interesting shot right here. This is like right in between clubs because I'm wanting to just carry it like 175. I don't think nine's enough though. And there's no trouble short, but I'm gonna hit eight iron. Might as well try and give it a chance. A little left. I think it's gonna be on the green though. Yeah, we should be putting unless it's short. 137 for her. A little bit of pressure on here because I put one in there maybe 15 feet. Gotta hit a good shot. Eight iron. Seems like the back of the stance is working well today. So we're gonna we're gonna roll with that. Alright. That's that terrible. Over? I felt like this was too much club. Guys, walking up to the green here. I'm just a tad long. She actually bounced over into the bunker. So not the easiest shot, but I mean, honestly, it's not a bad location for either of us. Nice shot. Wow. Solid. I'm gonna use 58 degree. This is a very makeable chip. A little bit left to right. Just gonna give it a run. Ooh. Good. Is that good? Uh, I'll have to see that one. I'm gonna go um, inside left. Wow. All right, we're on to uh, the fifth hole today. Match still all square. Couple good pars there. I got driver here. 
The miss seems to be a little right here. I was hitting this club good yesterday, so. 444 yards into the wind on this hole. This is not an easy hole, but if I can put a good tee shot out there, should have a good shot at the green. There you go. All right. That felt good. Turned through the ball good. Nice and compact. I'm just gonna um, take the driver right at the bunker out there. Nice. Nice shot. Thank you. Really bomb. Dude, I... Middle of the fairway, right side of it. That was kill. Where's yours? I actually have no clue. Could be in the bunker. Could be in the fairway. We'll see. 150 down the hill. It's probably going to play like 145. I'll take a 7 iron. Garrett's ball is nowhere to be found. So I'm in the driver's seat here. It's gonna work. Oh, that's work. really gonna work. Oh no. Oh, that's fine. Almost on the front. Okay. <laughs> this is the first time seeing this course, and I thought my tee shot was gonna be prime position, but unfortunately, it's in the bunker. And now, let's see how far we got. 153, gonna be like a little P wedge here, downwind. My biggest thing though is this lip. I'm just trying to get over that lip, give myself a putt. Go. Go. Dang it. Just short. Grant's saying this is pretty easy chip. I'll be honest, I don't really see what he's talking about. It's pretty tough. It's it's actually running away from me. Not much grain to work with. I just see it because it's the into grain. the grain. Wow. That's really good from there. Kind of a tight lie and it slopes away from me. I'm going to putt it, okay? I like it. For, for speed purposes. All right. You still not have a mark? No. <laughs> uh, shoot. Actually a really tough putt. Wow, that was really good. That really? was a 10. That was really good. Wow. Gosh. She's lights out with the putter. I have a feeling she's not going to be missing too many putts. But guys, after the fifth hole, the match is still all square. Hole six here, par four. This is a very short, tight hole. As Claire said, it's all about positioning on this hole. I mean, it's literally tighter than a hotel hallway. Like you can't really see much of the fairway. So I got hybrid guys. I'm just trying to put one in, in the fairway. Give myself a shot at the green. It's really short. It's like 350. So Let's see what we can do. Nice. All right. Sit. All right, middle of the fairway. I was thinking about hitting driver and I'm glad I didn't because probably wouldn't have went well. All right, got a three wood because it's a position hole. I'm teeing this one up extra high because I chunked my last three wood and hybrid. So I'm just gonna act like this is a driver in my head. Wow, that was perfect. Guys, I'm in the middle of the fairway. She's also in the middle of the fairway. About a 10 yard difference. So one thing that Grant and I were just saying is this course really does seem like a shot maker's course. You have to keep it in play. Every hole seemed pretty tight, so. I mean, just to even have these shots into the green, it's solid. Oh. Go that way. Oh. Oh. Stop it. Roll back. It's rolling. Okay. All right. I'll take it. Still rolling. 91. I got a 58 degree. She's in there pretty tight, so. I need to hit a good shot. Oh no. That's not good. Breaking right to left, and it's a quick putt. We gotta focus on the same thing. Tempo. Hopefully I can make this putt. Wow. That looked like a good stroke from over here. Alright, I'll take it. Dang. Actually I'll give you that one. This is a left to righter. Just gotta make sure I get it up on the line and let it kind of die in there. Stop. Stop. Oh. Stop. <laughs> That's fun. I love rolling in putts, especially when it's to go, what is it, one up in the match? <laughs> wow, that was actually a really impressive putt because that was not easy. You know? I will say she is the best putting stroke <laughs> I've witnessed. I'm not kidding. It's like literally perfect. She takes it to one up. Seven, eight, nine. Got to make a comeback. 210. I got a five iron or six iron. 
I'm still debating, depending on where the wind's at. I think we're gonna go... Great swing. Right. Yeah. Between five and six. It's rolling back towards the pen. I was thinking maybe it would have been a six, but didn't want to leave it short. Oh, uh, on 72. It's a five iron. Ooh. Oh no. Oh, okay, we're no. in play. We're in play, trust me. Oh, you're on the green. Oh, oh. it's on the green. Oh. It's rolling back. I don't know if putter's the play here. Okay. Do you want to try with your wedge and then your putter and see how it works out? Are you hitting putter? I am. This is like an insane putt. I can't win because if it ends up outside of like five feet, which it will, because this putt's like impossible, Garrett's just going to be like, Oh, look, you should have taken the wedge. And I'm going to be like, Okay, all right. Do you want to say something, Garrett? I'm good. I kind of need this one. <laughs> Looks like it's breaking a little right to left. Oh, fast. Hit the pin. Hit the pin. Hit the pin. Stop. Whoa. Oh my gosh. All right. I'm confident. Oh <laughs> I love playing golf, you know? I love it too, guys. It's so fun. <laughs> she literally does not miss. I don't even know what to say. I just gotta make it now. Mm. What a turn of events. Two down, two to play. That's not what we wanted. Not at all. Here we go, par five. Guys, that was an unfortunate series of events on the last hole. Gotta recover here, par five. Gotta make a birdie. Or an eagle. I mean, she's probably gonna make birdie at this point, so. It's actually gonna be fine. It's gonna be okay over there, actually. There's another hole, so. Garrett just hit it into no man's land. Pedal to the metal, driver. A little left. Yeah. That's okay. We're in the fairway. Rolling down. All right. Oh, didn't get the best break on that one. Kind of kicked down here, caught the cart path. Went over there, so I'm gonna take an unplayable. Yeah, yeah, right here's good. Like she said, she she actually did get a really rough break there because it was going into the fairway and just kept on rolling, so. But she's playing her third shot, so. I don't even know where my ball is. Mine could be in the water. Nice. Nice okay. shot. That's perfect. And how would you know? Because look at the slope. <laughs> I actually am in the wrong fairway. This is, I guess, the place to miss. I hit it so far right that I'm actually okay. All right, 241, I'm laying up. I'm hitting a four iron up this hill, just trying to put one in the fairway. Really good. That was a great swing. Perfect. Right over that tree. Okay. I'll trust her. 90 yards. Yeah. 54 in the back of my stance because I don't want to go long here. Oh, shoot. oh wait, that could work. <laughs> Why it is could that work. gonna be good? Sit. No. Sit. She's a runner. She's a track star. <laughs> Just left. That's okay. Oh, it's though. fine. That was hideous. I am honestly very shocked right now. I was trying to lay up because I had 240 into the wind up the hill, and my forehand got to the green. So I actually have a putt from here, right to left. I think it's gonna be pretty fast. After this part five, the eighth hole today, we got one hole left. I'm one down, one to play. I needed that. I needed that little birdie there. All right, Grant's telling me to go for it, which is definitely not. You're the one play. down. I got a six iron. I'm going up the right side. Grant, it doesn't matter. I can burn it from the mm. fairway. All right. Yeah, I can see oh, what you mean. Oh gosh. If that was with a driver, that would not have been good. So kind of bailed out right, but I should have a shot at the green which means I can make birdie and potentially send this to a playoff. Last hole of the day, he's probably up, you know, probably not in the water, but all I really need to do here is just probably par it. That'll close him out since he's dormy. Nice. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah. Okay, she actually is really intimidating to play against because she just doesn't miss, like she does not miss a fairway. This is really bad. I hit a six iron to lay up, 
and I hit it just right of the fairway and bounced all the way down here in between some trees. Odds of birdie now just go way down. Oh no, we're good actually. No, this is perfect. Prime position over here actually. Give him a look down the line. It looks really good. I'll be honest. You have to keep it so low. No, we're good. You gotta get it over the rock, under the tree. 161. Gotta put one close. Ooh. It sounds good. That's gonna go hard. Good job. Oh. Gracious. We're tipping. It's not looking good though, guys. She makes par. She's got a really good chance of winning from there. Not a good shot. I gotta hit a flop shot. She's in prime position. Potentially make another birdie. Let's see it. This is where our balls ended up down here, just in the rough. It's really a short-sided shot because we got to go over ridge. That's another thing. It slopes away from us. If you chunk it, it's going to roll back to our feet. So definitely don't chunk it. Yeah. Oh. Okay. That's the miss. A little long. That's better than short. True. Okay. I think I got to get aggressive though. I have to make par. I have to win the hole. She might make that putt to be honest with her track record today and her putting. So I need a different club. But I'm going to use this. I'm going to try and bump it into the hill. Wow. Ooh. Good shot. Ooh. Thank you. Okay, so this pie, it's kind of moving this way initially, and then toward the end, there's like another knoll there. So probably like net kind of straight. Uh, we're just going to trust it. Oh. Unreal. <laughs> do you normally? I, oh. I have a serious question. Do you normally putt this well? Hey, it was great playing with you. She denied Good the back. question. Sometimes. That was unexpected because I didn't even. And hey, I, hey, and I made it. it. Well, the you. pressure wasn't on though. All right, guys. That's about it for today's video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed that nine hole match with Claire over here. She did take the dub. I personally want a rematch. Maybe that will be happening soon. Stay tuned, guys. If you want to follow any of Claire's social media, it will be linked in the description down below. Have you started a YouTube channel by now? This is holding me accountable because as of right now, I technically haven't, but in the next month, I will. Okay, there you go. If you want to subscribe to her YouTube channel or follow her Instagram or any of her socials, it'll be linked in the description down below. Guys, until next time, y'all have a good one. Peace out.